Start a bit early. But if anyone's out there, hello. But if no one's out there, well, they control that cannon. Ooh, got a quest already. Hi, Calypso. Oh, so we got so I'm just. All right, so I've got a new star path. Okay. Well, I can unlock premium, so let's unlock premium right off the gate. Uh, uh, what should we should do? I've got a lot of them. Okay. Let's unlock some rewards straight off the gate. Alright, we'll we'll get this right off the bat. <laughs> Why not? Um and then what do I want to get? I've got fifty more. Get some of them. And we'll get some stitch. Cool. And then the second path. Oh, those are some good boosts. I'll wait a little bit. Oh, I got. Why is that locked? I need Woody, and I need Buzz Lightyear for those quests. I've got quests again. I haven't had quests for an age. I don't know if you know this clip, so I dressed up for it. So I got Stitch T-shirt, Woody's hat, Buzz Lightyear's pants. I'm a kid again. Oh, there's Merlin right there. All right, let's... Merlin has something important to tell me. All right, what do you want, Merlin? Hello. Ah, Dave, there you are. You must have heard me cry out Eureka from the Lakers Breakthrough. No, I don't pay any attention to you. Once you've done with the quest, you're dead to me. It took me days of careful research. And there was a uh, well here. There's one regrettable incident in which nearly turned my library into a toadstool. But I've made quite a discovery. Uh, tell me all about it. Is this a good kind of discovery? A discovery? Oh, no, I'm scared. All right, tell me all about it. I must say, it's quite refreshing to speak to someone who shares the thrill of discovery. I'm sure you recall the vitreous crystals found in the mines beneath, beneath Sunlit Plateau. I recall the mine that's, like, right next to, but not below. It's not really below. I've long suspected there were going to and uh, can't pronounce that. Properties might prove useful in other ways, and I've proved myself correct. I've created special elixirs that will help you carry out your duties. There's one for your royal shovel, one for your royal pickaxe, and one for your royal fish rod. You gotta stop calling them royal royal stuff, bro. They're not that royal. I hope Max is doing okay without. <laughs> what do you got for your fine question? There's no quick way to get to the bottom of things in a shovel that was there. If I apply the Miracle Shovel Varnish, you'll be able to discover more treasures by digging. In the end, as simple form, there are 10 vilest crystals, 10 pieces of dry wood, and a great deal of dream light. All right, what do you got? Quick hacks. As you must know, there's her. Fast men are clearing your problems away as well as quick hacks. That's true. A lot of mass murderers feel that way. And now, thanks to the mir this miracle, you could have just built this all in one sentence, bro. I'm sure Mr. McDuck will be happy to hear that. How oh, do I make it? It takes nothing more than ingenuity and or oh, 10 virus crystals, 5 pieces. What's Onyx? Onyx is a new thing. I didn't stock up on Onyx. And there's Donald just not... Yeah, I know Donald. I'm not happy about the scenario either. I just spent like weeks stocking up on stuff. Thanks, Donald. All right, what do you got for my fishing rod? Yes, there's nothing that captures the thrill of discovering fishing, is there? You never know what my own. If you use this miracle fishing bait, I'm sure just. You telling me to have no onyx? Onyx didn't exist in the game. I'm gonna have to look up what this onyx is. 
um, ensure to discover more waters of value than ever for to make your own you need virus crystals 10 what's red algae fetch five piece of red algae what's this red algae on extent and red algae is new too all right there's not what you, oh, I skipped all that I'm frustrated <laughs> I made a point to myself before starting stream I would not skip the dialogue because I always do uh, uh, anyway. What's all this stuff? I couldn't have done better myself. For our sake. So, seaweed. Nightshard and seaweed. Alright, alright, alright. Let's wind back here. So, nightshard is now under refined materials. Seaweed is too, but for some reason it's not unlocked. And now I've got all this new stuff. Everyone's been grinding something up from tears. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly, Red Queen. Uh, all right, so what I'm gathering here. Ah, so this is just a further extin extinction, a further um, development. I can't say words this morning. A further development on what we got last time. So last time we got these, there was a different image for them, but they're the ones that instantly grow your plants. So they've expanded that to give the other tools the same thing. So I'm guessing they, you know, you just get instant whatever. Okay. Now let's see ingredients. Is it coffee bean? We've got cocoa bean and now coffee bean. Wait, let's look at the map. Because these are things you collect off trees. Alright, I'm not seeing any trees anywhere. Any new trees. Like, all my trees are, are gathered here. Alright. I think Calypso is growing to you. I always come back. I'm like a rash. Bad rash. Anyway, <laughs> stop talking about things you can't get rid of. We've got this coffee bean, which for some reason I don't know where it is. And it's a fruit. Can I plant it? Is it something I plant? Let's see. A nice rash, yes. A nice rash when, like, when you scratch it, you get that really cool feeling. All right, there's no coffee bean there. All right, so that's different. We got a coffee bean. This red algae. So do I find the red algae? It's a forging material. It must be something I randomly find. Interesting. Um, so that's that's really throwing me off. So it must be. Must find it somewhere. Meals, though. Okay, so I unlocked pretty much everything here before the update. And now there's 13 new recipes, one new ingredient, one new forging thing, which is the red algae, five new fish, best of squid. They've just put Christmas hats on them. I don't know whether to be impressed or criticize how lazy that was. You could basically do that for every holiday now and just make like 10 new different kinds of fish. But yeah, that's... Now I have to unlock all those. Those ones are hardest. The, the Fuji, Fuji's are hardest because you only can catch them during a storm. Ah, oh, which is going to suck. Okay, all right. This is going to hamper a little bit on my unlocking ability. So obviously they've introduced the surprise character Stitch. So we need to unlock Stitch today try to and also toy story so that's gonna be fun i'm um, crafting so looking at these crafting so that's another 23 they've added oh got a campfire we've got some gifts okay anything else we've got some festive stuff so a, a holiday feast chair and canara i think it's a, um, medora 
I'm not religious. I have no idea. A photo backdrop. Okay. There was one out of two on Mickey. Oh, that's the costume. That's what I thought. That's the skins that they want. Interesting. Well, shouldn't Merlin have one too? Hold up. Hold up. Oh, yeah. Merlin's got one too. So that's gonna ha that's how you're gonna be able to select the skins for them, which I I actually like. I think it adds like something special to it. Clothing they've increased it by fifty. Or not fifty, because I had ten left to go, so forty. It would have been about forty. So I've added quite a lot. You can't still can't minimize them, so I have to scroll down. And to be honest, I don't pay enough attention to which clothing I actually had unlocked and not unlocked. But I'm just seeing if there's anything that jumps out. Leo and Stitch has got an item now, which is interesting. Now a lot of general items. And it looks like furniture went up as well. Gems is on there's of oh, the stupid onyx. But it doesn't tell me where I can get it from. Like all of them are, there's like where to find it. But it's a good start. It's a good start. It's me, Donald Duck. I, I, we know. We know Duck. Well, that's got a hidden requirement. That's mean. I don't know what a hidden requirement is. So we could. Now, is there is there anything on the map that's different? No. And um, where's Stitch? Because I they released a trailer today, and it showed Stitch crashing on the beach but also um it, it did say that they fixed the bug about critters so there's one critter i can't unlock that appears oh it's not here today god damn it the classic sea turtle i can never unlock for some reason but they said they fixed the bug so i'm gonna want i really want to unlock that there he goes again he, he's mad about the onyx still i get it donald can't believe they did that i stopped up for no reason <laughs> no nah. I was going to do that anyway because I'm a crazy person. But still, I would normally have the music on. Yeah, I know, Donald. I'm upset too. It's ridiculous. Got a little bit of content to do. I'm worried I'm going to run out really quickly, so I'm kind of procrastinating a little bit. And I know it's like new content, new content, but I want to do this. There's no rush on it because once it's done, it's done thing that's making me unnerving though is hidden requirement what does that mean what does hidden requirement mean because if it's hidden requirement it means i have to try and figure it out and i'm not very good at figuring it out this is why i have the internet it's so i don't need to figure out things and i can just google it oh actually another thing they introduced is the two limits now ah there you go so I'm well over the hidden limit. Well, now I guess it's not hidden anymore. So I only can have 3,000 objects. I'm going to have to rethink my, my plan. I don't know if I can place the housing as well. That's going to be tricky, but we'll deal with that when it comes to it. Oh, and they said they upgraded Christos place. So I'm going to have to look into that. So what, I'm probably going to put Stitch's place, like there. If I can unlock him, there's no quest to unlock him, which is confusing. I'm not entirely sure what's going on there. Yeah, I know, Donald. It's, it infuriates me too. Now, one thing apparently they've changed is in Kristoff's stall, you can buy more items. So let's check that. Yep, same items as last time, but apparently they are going to introduce um, buying iron from here. So I guess we will see. All right, let's dump everything. And let's unlock Woody and Buzz. I could get rid of all my pumpkins. Now that's like, looking at now I'm thinking about it because I'm probably going to have to get underneath this limit Hundred and so I need about 120 to get rid of 
and there's one to ten. So that's 130. So I could cut it back to that. Yes. Something. It's gonna hurt. I'm gonna cry, but kinda needs to be done. Alright, so here. Oh, there's Donald raging about the Onyx again. I get it. I know, man. Sucks. Alright, so where is the magical door? There it is. This is the Toy Story door. 7,000 dream light. I don't know if I can afford it. I've got 170. Behind the store, you'll find friendly living toys. Only you can use your dream light to open the store. Alright, so stupendous. You've unlocked the Toy Story realm. Well, you run along now. My secret mission into uncharted space. Alright, let's do this. Seems a lot, yeah. There's Buzz. So it's, um, it looks like, was it Molly? What was her name? One that took over from Andy's room. I think the music's a bit. Music sounds a bit off. Okay. Um. Interesting. Yeah. The trumpet's really off. Pick up key. Glad to see you. I'm afraid I'm in desperate need of assistance. To the rescue. <laughs> Wait a minute. You don't look like Bonnie. That's her name. Bonnie. Bonnie's toys. Um. I'm not a toy. I'm a limited edition Dave action figure. Why is everything so big? I think I'm a limited edition Dave action figure. Impressive. And look at all those points of articulation. Uh, Bonnie's okay. parents must have bought you recently. Okay. So, I'm not really a toy, but I like to... Oh, I see. Why would you say that, Dave? Uh, my name's Dave. What do you need me to do? Well, I was in the middle of a very important rescue mission, and suddenly... Bzz, there's a secret mission. An uncharted space. Okay. No, no. It's happening again. It's happening again? My batteries are depleting. And now my electronic features are acting up. My voice box keeps trick to infinity and beyond. And my laser won't stop firing in random times. Need not worry though, it's just a light bulb. Say no more, why don't you just stay here while I find you some new batteries. There should be some spares around the room. Check over there by the closet. Or maybe near the bzzz. There's an intergalactic emergency. Over by the what? There's no time. Search the room for AA batteries and try not to bzz. I protect the galaxy. Whatever you do, do not bzz. Buzz like you to the rescue. <laughs> Alright, so that explains why the music's a bit off. Yeah, that's why the trumpet's off. Yeah, and why he's a bit off. So, we need to find some AA batteries. Well, there's a penguin over here. Oh, there's a chest. Well, let's open the chest. But it's just money because I'm on lots of too much stuff. By the closet. Where's the, the closets there? Alright. Go over here. Oh, there. Oh, I need to find two. I need to find two batteries. You saw it? Where? Where, where, where? Where, where did you see it? You saw it, so I have to... I'll double back. I'll start doubling back. Oh, uh... By the book stack. Oh, there. Thank you. Thanks, Clipso. <laughs> Give the items, yep. Yeah. Oh, don't spoil it at all. No. More fun this way. I hope these batteries work. But, like, yet to the wrist. Something's still not right. Maybe if I fiddle with the switch in the back. Alright. Left or right? Well, that's a bit of a lottery, isn't it? Left or right? Well, I'm right-handed. So we should always do the opposite of Dave. So left. <laughs> oh, it's Spanish now. And I don't know Spanish. 
Uh oh, that's not right. Yeah, I guess that's the wrong way. Switch back, feel that's better. Ah, uh, I knew it. Yeah, there you go. I wonder if it does that regardless of which way you do it, though. Uh, no, we solved that problem. What are you sending me? All right. Mm. I'm, oh, I skipped it. Damn it. But the mission. What? Oh no, I skipped the mission. Uh, mm. Woody got knocked out the window while on re reconnaissance. Woody got knocked out the window. We've got to rescue him. I'm way ahead of you, my friend, but I like your enthusiasm. I try to help him get back inside, but the window slammed down, and locked. Unfortunately, the latch is too mm. high to reach. I was in the middle of executing a rescue mission when my battery started acting up. Rescue mission? What were you planning? Do you see the race car tracks all over the room? Yes, I do. Well, I was planning on building a track and launching a tall toy car at the latch of the window. But if it's hit precisely at the right angle, it'll unlock and Woody can get back inside. Uh, There's just a few parts of the track left to put together. All right, so we'll be yeah, putting together yeah. track. Would you like to assist me? Oh, Billy. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Didn't he grow up to be a like, garbage collector? Wasn't that the law? Um, would you care to assist me? It's time. Oh, shields at maximum, because I'm a nerd. <laughs> I take that as a yes. Let's start by finding the rest of the pieces of uh -huh. the track. If you could bring them back to me, once you've got them all, we can finish it together. All right, I so. Um, I found out also, Buzz Lightyear is actually voiced by Tim Allen, so that's pretty cool. In the game. Um, search the room. So we're gonna have to find 10 pieces of track. And looking up, up here, I'm not seeing any pieces, so that's that's not a good sign. Oh no, they're right there. Alright, so that's one. That's another. Oh, those those are those. That's not that. Those are those. Of course they're those are those, Dave. Those are those are those. Oh, there's another one there. Hold up. Oh, there's another one there. There you go. Thanks, club, sir. You're going to get so frustrated because you're going to be like pointing at the screen. It's like there, there. But because of the, de the couple second delay, I already passed it. All right, we've got six, we've got four more to go. I'm pretty sure there's probably more than 10 spread out the room. Oh, there's an arm. So we've got one more to go. No, there you go. There you go. Greetings. I am Buzz Lightyear. Looks like you found all the pieces of track. Good work. Now let's finish building it together. Alright. Hey. Could have, could have at least shown me. Anyway. You did it. All the pieces of the race tr track are back in place. But some of them aren't right. What are we supposed to do now? Hmm. Let me think about it. I got it. We'll use the local vegetation to help us. Vegetation like plants? Mm -hmm. Precisely. There are some magic growing cactuses scattered around the room. Magic growing cactuses? What are those? <laughs> Don't let the name fool you. They're not really magic, but they are quite a feat of engineering. They are the small toy cactuses that Bonnie received as a gift. When you add water, they grow. If you place them under the race car tracks and add a little liquid, They'll grow and lift the race car tracks. They'll get all sucking around the real mess on their hands. Uh, that. Not with these magic growing cactuses. <laughs> They're top of the line. When they grow, they lift the track mm -hmm. in place. However, there's one problem. The water. I'm not exactly a waterproof toy. Don't worry. My trusty watering can will take care of that. <laughs> Excellent. Let's find those magic growing cactuses. So we can use, my friend. Okay. Till we meet again. All right, so we need to find the. I'll gather the five magic cats scattered around the room. It's a random penguin. I keep coming back to this damn penguin, and it feels like it's deliberate. What's that? That's. That wasn't a cactus. I... What? 
What? Mag I'm reading this right. Magic growing cactuses. That's a button. Like. It's either a button or a butt. I don't. My brain just. I mean, what else would you call that? Don't touch the butt. Nemo! He touched the butt. I am. Th I was thoroughly confused. That's that not. I'm glad I'm not the only one that just had to double take that. But I'm glad you were there for that moment because. Yeah. So I need one more. There's one more butt around. There's the, the final butt. Go. These squishy little cats. They're, they're butts. Split. All right. Oh yeah, I move them. Yeah. Oh, I have to put two under. I'll stand by that. Yeah, thank you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Alright, they're not appearing, but they... Oh, no, they are appearing. They're, they're just under there. Alright, I thought that was a bug. Cool. And I've got one more. Alright, one more over here. Cool. Now I have to water them. Alright. Oh, whoa, whoa. Well, okay. Okay, this makes sense now. Looking at the animation, it makes sense why it looked like a butt. It still looked like a butt. Oh, there you go. Oh, whoa, 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 there you go. Oh, it's got faces on them too. I didn't even notice the face. You can't really see the face. It's facing the wrong way. But those have got faces in there. Okay. I kind of like them now. I kind of wish I had them in my valley. And this one. There you go. Oh, there's a little kid. Hello. Anything to report? We'll call them butt caddises. Do you have a status report? The, the track is in place in the right elevation. Excellent work. Just one uh, left thing to do. Take this toy car. Or do we get to ride on it? Oh, I bet you we don't. Huh. I bet it's going to do a silly little cutaway. Climb the ladder and push along mm. the track. With enough momentum, we should be able to unlock the window and save Roger Woody. That. Okay. Toy oven. Ah, oh, there. Toy oven. Ah, there. Woo! You know, Buzz, I've seen you do many things in movies. I've seen you like jump across the room, glide and all that. You couldn't go from, you you literally could have, where you're standing now, buddy, you could have just moved that, like something, like a book. You could have been like that cup. You could have moved that cup to there, reached up and under. Easy, bloody. Wow, hello there. Howdy, partner, I'm wearing a hair. Or planted the butt. Yeah, he could have planted the butt or used the teacup to undo the latch. You lazy bugger. Partner, you must be Dave. I don't know why I'm talking like this, but Woody doesn't talk like this. But I'm talking like this anyway. I can't do an American accent. I guess you've got... I've got you to thank for helping Buzz unlock the window. He's... To be fair, you should be criticizing Buzz more than thanking me. Yeah, I, I don't want to say the response. Because none of them criticize Buzz in this situation. Whatever they thought Tori need, I'll do the... He has a massive head. Yeah, he does. That's what she said. That's what she said! <laughs> um, Buzz said you got knocked out of the window on some kind of mission. What were you doing? Well, Bonnie's family is off on a vacation and she left us behind to take care of something for her. <laughs> she wants us to put on a play when she gets back. A play? What sort of play? With Bonnie's imagination, you never know. Well, that's not much of a director, is it? Imagine like, like, 
you going away and go, all right, I want you guys to develop a play for me. I'm, I'm not going to tell you what it's about or what it is, but it's got to be good. I hate Bonnie. My girlfriend rages at, about Bonnie. Never mentioned Toy Story 4 around her. Like, I know you, you won't technically because you'll probably never meet her, but just never mention Toy Story 4. Like, the rage she comes with Woody becoming a lost toy. Okay. With Bonnie's imagination, you never know, but she has made a little farm out of pipe cleaners and ice pop sticks. And then she made a whole bunch of animals for it out of construction paper. Oh, that's why the animals are around. Yeah. Uh, that's, that's a lot of work. It does. I'm lazy, so yeah. Bonnie loves her arts and crafts. She's a real creative kid. But wait, where is the farm? Here. Well, uh, Bonnie's farm got knocked over and it broke and the pieces are shed all over the room. Oh no, that's awful. Yep, it's just about broke my heart seeing it all pieces. Yeah. So Buzz and I decided to rebuild Bonnie's farm, not just how she left it. Um, you're a good toy, Woody. Any kid would be lucky to have you. Oh shucks, thanks. I want to make sure everything's perfect when Bonnie gets back. Um, I think I may have some leaves stuck under my hat. Why don't you talk to Buzz and he'll brief you on the rest of the plan. Well, it doesn't explain why it was out the window though. You heard that? Oh, you probably heard that. But that's what she said. Hello. Um, Woody filled me in on the situation. How are we going to put Bonnie's farm back together again? Uh -huh. Well, I've been thinking Bonnie made a special blueprints that show exactly how she wanted to look. They're still taped around the room. Hmm. You mean those drawing on the walls, the ones on colored construction paper? Impressive observational skills, Dave. Yeah. There's just one problem. Some of them are hard to reach. Woody got himself knocked out the window trying to get them all. So he got knocked out the window trying to reach the blueprints. All right. Could I take, uh, hmm, I could take all the pictures of the drawings with my camera. Okay. Excellent idea. Then we'll look at the drawings and recreate the farm the exact way Bonnie wants using all the tools at your disposal. How? Yeah, now that's thinking like a space ranger. Just let me know as soon as you have all the pictures in the drawings. I appreciate the help. Okay. Buzz, you need to question Woody on how why he fell out there. Because there's no drawings around the window. I mean, do, are those the drawings? There's only four of them. None of them is about a farm. I don't think... Yeah, Buzz. What is lying to you? There's no. What was he reaching for? There's nothing here. He's trying to run away from you. You're too. Look at look how creepily you're looking at him right now. And he's trying to look everywhere but you. Look at his eyes. He doesn't want to look at you, and you're staring at him. Buzz, you have a possessive relationship with Woody. You're codependent. No. <laughs> He tried to run from you. <laughs> oh well. Destruction. Oh, the the color. There's some there. Let's um. Is that? I don't see if that count. Oh no. Um. I can take two cards. Um. I only can do that. Uh, change inventory. No. Oh yeah, that counts it. So that's one. Even though I was pointing at it, my finger was covering half of it. There's some more here. There you go. Alright, that's two. Oh, so, yeah, I'm missing two. Well, there's that one. But you wouldn't have fallen out the window there, would you? Would you? Huh? You, you were supposed to grab this one that was on the ground and somehow you fell out of that window. It's a cry for help, guys. It's a cry for help. Right, let's take this damn picture. So, oh yeah, the last one's here. There you go. Greetings. 
Excellent surveillance work, Dave. Now we can recreate Bonnie's farm exactly how she wants it. Let's see. Yep, Bonnie's has big dreams for this little settlement. Her drawings are quite detailed. No. Um, of course we could add it. Uh, no, that would never work. What wouldn't work? I was just thinking we could improve on this design, but we need materials we won't find here in Bonnie's room. Some of some flowers, perhaps some adhesive bonding agent. I think I know we could find all that. Come with me to Dreamlight Valley. Dreamlight Valley? Is that some sort of expensive place yet? It is. Um, or a themed family eatery like Pizza Planet. Uh, no. Dreamlight Valley is... A new place for you to explore. A place where toys never get put in an attic. The most amazing village in the quadrant. Now, none of these options is what I want to pick. So... I'm going to go for the nerd option because of quadrant. Really? Well, I think we ha uh, it will have the materials we need to help Bonnie. Then I suppose I ought to visit. Go, uh, go on a recon mission. Just wait here. I'll get a special command set, set up for you in the village. A re oh, we're going to be building a spaceship for Buzz probably. Huh? A real ship? Like in, like in the animated short Bonnie watches? Will it... Have a hyperdrive. It'll be a, it will have a, a hyperactive drive. I can't wait to see it. Cool. So we're going to be making oh places Buzz's RV. All right, we're going to be placing his RV. All right, let's go. The Toy Story residential area, which has been here and it's a bit messy at the moment, so let's clean this up a little bit. And this is the Toy Story residential area. I was planning to put Buzz and Woody. Buzz's RV. No. No. So I'm 120 items over the, the now visible limit. And 10 items, 11 technically, over the unique item limit. Which is silly to have a limit of only 600, considering that there are over a thousand different items in the game, but you only can place like half of them nearly. All right, so I've got to figure out how to get the limit down in order to place Buzz's uh, V. I'm going to have to get rid of my bunkins. So, this is going to hurt. But, I mean, I've got a lot of money. I mean, I've got a lot of money. It'll be fine, Dave. Alright, well... If you're gonna, if, Dave, if you're going to do this, do it right. Trap um, Wally in a fence. And make the most of it. I wonder if they, they added more... No, 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 no. Oh, they've added some more. Of the ho, ho, ho. Want to build a snowman. Okay. Add more of those. And oh, mine, rubies, sapphires, and crystals. They've added those too. Well, that's mean because I've been mining those for a while. All right. Come here. Come here, buddy. Come here. Come here. Uh, all right. Oh, it's not going to let me do the fence. So that was excluded from the invisible limit before, and now it's included. What? 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 Why did I pick up Onyx? All right, I'm going through a lot of emotions right now. So, so... Not only is the, the fence is now included into the so-called invisible limit, I just picked up Onyx randomly. So it appears to be just a, another gem that you randomly pick up. The same way you pick up like coal and stuff. 
Interesting. No, the reason why you want to put him in a fence is because he bothers you while you're trying to mine. Oh, uh, trying to, to farm. But in this scenario, we don't have a choice. So let's just do this, buddy. I didn't think I'd be doing this on update day. Like, the reason why I get my money up and kept it where it is, so I wouldn't need to, like, farm pumpkins. Actually, now I can do a test. Something I've always wanted to do. Sweet, I'll just trigger those. So I don't know whether these sparkling holes reduces that limit. So this is the limit at the moment. Cool. So if I do this, oh, do. It did. So that tells me those holes do contribute to the so-called invisible limit. All right, let's bring down some of the limit. Now, this, this doesn't bring down the invisible limit, just farming the pumpkins. Digging up the holes does. So that's really what this is for. Done. So that has brought me under the invisible limit, but I'm still... 10 items above it and I'm guessing that's gonna yeah I'm still gonna need to get under that 10 unique limit limit Eclipso how about this you decide should I get rid of Cinderella or Beauty and the Beast sections Cinderella all right let's get rid of Cinderella as much as this sucks but it does get us under that limit safely we are good um liking things thus far um i should be smart about this and do that and remove all and just like that it's gone but at least we can put buzz up now let's clear the air rear all right cool all right let's place the rv i'm probably gonna have to do some tweaking where everything's sitting Okay, where we've got so this the entrance is here. So let's um let's move this around slightly. Or we'll put put that there. Yeah. We we'll probably move that out a little bit and we'll put the coffee or we'll put the coffee table like here. I know this is like not important, I can do this later, but I'm gonna do it now. Cool. Alright, and then we'll put but uh buzz's rv here all right get rid of that all right so how much is it going to cost me oh, greetings, ah dave how can i help you today buzz lightyear is coming to a village on a top secret mission and needs a special mobile command center a mobile command center eh well i think i've got just the thing if you wouldn't pay me a reasonable price that is i can't do a scottish accent i'm not even going to try uh, 10,000, ah, uh, can we afford, yeah, I'm pretty sure we can afford it. See, this is what grinding does. This is a benefit of grinding right now. Preparing for an update, I don't need to muck around with money. Cool. I must say, I'm looking forward to having a wee lad back in the village. Having, oh, wait, 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 wait. I must say, I'm looking forward to having the wee lad back in the village. So he remembers Buzz. After all, beneath all that molded plastic beats a heart of a miniature just like me. So he remembers Buzz like you. Interesting. There we go. The RV. Welcome, Buzz Lightyear. Oh. Yay! All right, we'll have to take a take a bloody picture with him. Oh. oh. Oh God! Mate, <laughs> this is how my body feels right now. All right, and uh, and we unlocked repair houses as well. All right, all right, Buzz, come here. Greetings. I so this, like why are you so enormous? Um, your toy size. Yes. Because I'm, I'm awake. Wait, 
If you're not a toy, I'm breaking the toy rule number one. True. He's pointed out a big flaw that it would have taken me a little bit while to remember to, to click. That's to be honest, that's clever writing. Address the problem earlier. I'm addressing oh sorry, I'm breaking a toy rule number one. I was supposed to drop to the ground and pretend to be animate. That's clever. I have to admit, I'm giving the writing staff the props on this one. Because people would have brought that up. Like, someone would have mentioned, like, oh, blah, blah, blah. But they have addressed it right off the bat. And that's good. I don't think toys need to do that here in Dreamlight Valley. The line between what's a toy and what's a toy, what's real and what's pretend. Well, it's all a little fuzzy here. Mm, no. Um, well, uh, I guess I'll have to take your word for it. I mean, they got out of that really easy with the explanation, but kudos. You know, it's the strangest thing. Now I'm here in this valley seems familiar. Woody and I, we've been here before, haven't we? This place, it was a place where no toy went unloved and everyone had a purpose. Except for Donald. Um, don't worry, all your memories should start to come back soon. I hope so. This is unsettling. For now, I'll do some surveillance and see if I can get reacquainted. Great. I'll go see Woody, Woody and we'll keep working on Bonnie's farm. Cool. Um, so that's added Buzz Lightyear. Um, and now we can unlock Woody. Where are you, Buzz? Where are you, buddy? Where'd you go? Alright, you're over there. Oh, you're hard to spot, aren't you? Here you are. You are very hard to spot. Hey there. Um. Oh, you can't follow me yet. Alright, yeah. we'll gain some experience here. Um, attention, Dave. This is a Zerg invasion drill. Um, an invasion. Oh. Give me the details. Emperor Zerg has sent three spaceship craft to attack a valley that armed with lasers converging on a castle. How would you respond? Um, ask Merlin, ask Mickey, invite them to a picnic. Merlin with magic, that would be cool. Leveraging the valley's unique advantage sounds a sound tactic. Zerg doesn't know about magic. he would be completely famoxed. Well done, Dave. You passed the invasion drill with flying colors. If this has been a real invasion, the valley would be safe. I appreciate that. Hey there. All right. So he's nearly there. What's his gifts? Let's let's get this out of the way, actually. Oh. That's just convenient. Cool. All right. Uh, he's level three now. That was massive. Um, you have my appreciation. May I have your attention? Do, 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 do. Yeah. So we're up two there. And these weird buttons. Oh, cool backpack. All right. So, now, he's small. Now, I have to be careful. Oh, hey, Ina. G'day. Glad you arrived. So, he's small. And I found the bigger companions that are more of a hassle to have around. So, I've already got Remy, who is a, a small, because a rat, um, doing mining. So, I probably want him to be something similar. So I don't want them to be mining, but I want them to be forged, digging, fishing, or gardening. Digging. All right, we'll go over digging. All right. Cool. Dig. We'll go digging. Over here. There we go. Uh, we can the favorite gift. Perfect. All right. Greetings. I'm Buzz Lightyear. There we go. All right, Dave. I've done thorough surveillance, but I'm on. Ah, oh, sorry. I didn't realize you're on, on that. Sorry. I'm I'm a bit like I'm not a morning person. I'm a bit snarky today. Sorry, mate. I didn't mean that. I mean it with love. There you go. Um, Dave, I've been f for a thorough surveillance of the valley, and uh, I've yet to find the best way to make myself useful here. Could you assist me? I'd love to help. And great. Well, I'm not used to feeling unsure of myself. I've become quite skilled at being a toy, but. Here, I don't fear. I, I don't have to freeze whenever a human walks by. Everyone I speak to is so tall. Add to that, some of you have magical powers. I may have a karate chop action, high pressured space wings, but I don't have that. So Buzz is really depressed. So that's that. 
Um, your hair in your way. Okay, what do you think Buzzy would, about, or Woody would do? You're my friend, never doubt yourself. You're a hero in your own way. That's from Dr. Horrible. Um, everyone's a hero in their own way. Yep, that's the line. Um, be right back on Jordan PC. Oh yeah, fair enough. Um, I'm glad you think so. I am maybe a foot tall and made of plastic, but part of me will always feel like a real space ranger. That's it, Buzz. That's what you can do around here. You can set up a Star Command outpost. You mean like a lo local law enforcement unit? Hmm, that might work. I could go on missions, undercover mysteries and patrol. Oh, I hope we get a new building. And my first act would be to recruit you into our ranks. Welcome aboard, cadet. We'll use the RBS Star Command headquarters, but we also need to build tra a transportation fleet. I'll make a Space Ranger ship to put in front of it. Uh, this will be a lot of fun. That's the spirit. A Space Ranger ship shouldn't be too difficult to construct for someone with your talents. Yeah, because I farmed everything. Um, you'll need glass, hardwood, and iron. Oh, not iron! Whatever. Mission accomplished. Whatever, Buzz. Hey there. They knew. They knew we didn't have a lot of iron. They knew iron was hard to, hard to farm. This was a deliberate action against me, <laughs> against me personally. It's still level three, but this should boost him to level four. Perfect. You have my appreciation. Cool. Whoa. Yeah. To level four. All right. So let's craft his funky little spaceship. So, oh, I've actually got everything. Cool. I must have had enough ironing. Oh, that's right. I farmed the other day. I complained about it and didn't need to. Right. Space Ranger ship. Alright, let's build it. Yay. Oh, it's a biggie. It's a big one. We might need a bit more. Hmm. May have to. May have to move a few things around. But. this back a bit and hmm. How about um, move that there and then move that there and then and where should we put the coffee thing? Um everyone needs coffee so we'll just put it in the center there for now. Ah, uh, that works for now. Cool. Now return to bus. Alright. Nice work, cadets. Now let's hop in and head out and patrol. Uh, I made the space to your specification, so it's kind of small. It's going to be tight squeeze for me. Ah, uh, yes. I can see how that would be a problem. Also, you're not exactly ready to be an official special ranger duties yet. Before we do anything else, we need a proper oh. uniform. I understand Scrooge McDuck is in charge of commerce around here. I suggest you speak to him. All right, let's go. All right, Scroogey. Hey, Dave. What do you need today? Uh, I need a recreation. Uh, uh, Space Ranger. It's essential for my new role as a cadet. That's tall, Dave. I haven't got anything like that in my regular inventory. You'd be better off wishing for a st on a star. Of course, for the right price. And if you bring me the materials, I'm sure I can make you something to do the trick. First, I need you to make some navy blue dye. For that, you'll need some falling blue Pissamons, blueberries, and coal. I've got all that. That's the grinding for you. Um, so the NPC costumes a thing that was yes, it was. Um, I'll show you in a sec. Um, okay, so what else? In addition, I need blue. I need fibers. That, that's easy enough. And topaz. All right, that's easy. Thank you. I need to craft some blue dye. Cool. Oh, fiber and softwood. Wait, how, how come I don't have software? Oh, I need to have it in my inventory. All right, come. Well, oh, that's easy enough to do. All right, all right, Scroogey. Let's give you all these. Oh, 
Oh, greetings, Nemo. Well, bless me. Bless me, bagpipes. Could they be any more stereotypical? Um, a topaz. Just as I asked. Thank you, Dave. Now, let me work my magic. Blue. And here it is. One Space Ranger uniform. Straight from the touch of magic machine in my shop. Wait. Straight from the touch of magic machine from the shop. Where's that? And I'm not liking this, this, uh, this craftsmanship. I don't feel like this. I mean, to be honest, I don't have much of an option, but, um, yes, it better not be just made a comment. I didn't think you'd be disappointed, Dave. I better, better put the space uniform on before I go back to Buzz. Thank you kindly. So I just did all that and I'm going to look like a fool, aren't I? I can't believe I paid for this. That's ridiculous. I mean, it looks funny, but yeah, I do look funny, but I mean, I mean, you imagine going to the store and going, Hey, I, I, I need a custom spacesuit made for somebody who are, who I'm trying to bring up and bring his spirits back. Um, and he's feeling really down and I just want to make him feel better. So I really want to make a good suit. And he's like, all right, cool. You get me some dye and like a, a shiny gem. Get me all this wood. And I, I don't know. Um, how about you get me all this fiber too and we'll make something wicked. And then you get that. So, um, so <laughs> I'm sorry, Ina, for, for you being in pain. Well, just on a side note. All right, Buzz. Dave, you look ready to make any threat to the galaxy. Do you feel sorry? No, I do not. Um, I look ridiculous. I'm going to do how I feel. I'm not going to fluff it up. So I look ridiculous. It does take time to get used to, but I've been wearing my uniform for well ever. And I, and I can promise you it's surprisingly comfortable and I think it'll grow on you. Now, thanks to your enrollment, there's someone to hold down the command post while I go on my first patrol. I'll let you know if I encounter anything suspicious. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to ask for an opinion here. Should I continue to wear this? For, for today. Um, there's only, there's only a couple of people in chat or people watching the sign site. But they're going to decide whether I will continue to wear this for the rest of the update. Democracy.